Hey folks, Chris Salter here in MLC Atlanta office. Thanks for joining us for the 2022 What's New event. I'd like to take a few moments here to just go over some of the great tools that are available in SOLIDWORKS 2022 for managing large assemblies. Now, if you know from a previous release of SOLIDWORKS, we introduced what's called Large Design Review. Now, Large Design Review is a mode that allows you to open up massive assemblies with very few limitations. The large and complex, over 6,000 component Nemo submersible U-boat actually opens in merely 13 seconds, allowing you to get to work faster. New for 2022 is the ability to easily open drawings from a large design review assembly in detailing mode, right from the right mouse menu. Detailing mode is an extremely efficient way to both open and work on your existing drawing documents. Like opening the large assembly of the Nemo, the drawing is opened rather quickly as well in only 21 seconds. Detailing mode is a fully interactive way to work with your large designs and large drawings that have already had the reviews created. In this environment, you can continue detailing your drawing, adding dimensions, notes, tables and more. The ability to quickly access drawings from large design review mode in this way will streamline how you work with your large complex designs. Additionally, in 2022, you can open sub-assemblies from large design review mode in this lightweight format as well. This ensures that you're not loading any unnecessary information that's not currently needed. Whenever you want to access to the fully resolved models, you can choose to open them from the same right mouse menu. Likewise, you can always, re always resolve an assembly that is already opened in large design review mode. This ability to access lightweight files and quickly switch between them will ensure that you can work in the most efficient way possible. Moving components is now easier in SOLIDWORKS 2022. When selected from the feature manager tree, you're now presented with a triad that makes it extremely simple to get a component to just the correct spot with controls for X, Y, Z and rotation all at your fingertips. The QuickMates toolbar in 2022 also gives you more control by presenting you with the option to make adjustments before adding the mate such as alignment. This is also true when adding circular type mates, where you will be given the opportunity to lock the rotation of them before confirming. This is especially useful in the case of mates that allow for both of these conditions. The ability to add this extra control while mating with the QuickMates toolbar makes it fast and simple to quickly build your assemblies. The intelligent pattern driven component pattern get even smarter in SOLIDWORKS 2022. Now, when you choose a component to pattern, SOLIDWORKS will always choose that component's location as the seed for determining how to create and position other instances. Even if you change the location of the component to a different location, the pattern still assumes that the component you are patterning is the seed position. This means it's much easier to take advantage of existing patterns and whole wizard features to quickly position multiple instances of components such as hardware and rapidly, rapidly populate your assemblies. Configurations are a powerful way to create alternative versions of parts and assemblies all within a single document. You can now choose to have instances of components included or excluded from different versions of the design. You can also choose to use alternative configurations of other components in each configuration. The possibilities are endless. And as more variations are made, keeping track of this can get complicated. However, new in SOLIDWORKS 2022 is the new configuration table. This table makes it much easier to both create and manage configurations. From the table, you can add new versions to your design, and you can also choose to toggle the suppression state of different components on and off. Likewise, you can specify which versions of components to use in each configuration. The controls make it easy to see your changes while you're working as well. If you make changes to the configuration manually, such as suppressing components that weren't included before, they will, 
they will be added to the table as well. The configuration table also has filters to make it easier to focus on what's important. For example, you may want to ensure that the custom properties for each configuration are unique to each new version of the assembly. Finally, when looking at a bill of materials, there will be cases when components in the design should not be included. This option can be controlled from the component properties in the assembly to specify this. However, this can become time consuming for parts that regularly should not be included. New for SOLIDWORKS 2022 is the new configuration option at the component level where you can specify that a component should have this option enabled by default, saving you the time from having to change this each time the component is used. SOLIDWORKS 2022 introduces a wide variety of performance and usability improvements to ensure that you can focus on the engineering of your design and less time on determining how to manipulate them.